dead. It's all over, Chaplin. I gotta drop it now. Here it goes. and I'll give you the death you didn't have the spine to give me. They're down! The machines! All of them! They're down! What? How's that possible? Regala! Enough bloodshed! Let's settle this. You and me. Easy to say when you're atop a machine. Well, that was just to get your attention. I don't need any help to take you down. Fine. I accept your challenge. And once I'm done with you, I'll get to finish the slaughter. We'll see about that. The duel is set. Let none interfere.
here I am again, on my knees before bootlets and cowards. Go ahead, run me through. Shut your mouth, traitor. It was you who flew in on the wings of the Ten. You who challenged her by our rights. You must decide her fate. I spared her once. It only made things worse. She was the best of my marshals. What a waste. She's dangerous, all right. But maybe that's exactly what I need. Cowards! What more do you have to conspire about? Whether you live or die, I'm not here to forgive you for your crimes, but there's another battle ahead against an enemy more powerful than anything you can imagine. And I need people, a squad, that's willing to do whatever it takes. I don't want your mercy. It's not mercy. The battle I'm talking about will be charging into a nightmare. A better death than this? Yes. My blood is yours. Your enemies are mine. Meet us at our stronghold in the mountains near Plainsong. You mean to send her alone? Without even an armed guard? She does not need it. I will be there. You have my word. I'll hold you to it. Chief, there's something you both need to see. In the throne room. He surrendered to our guards outside the grove. Claims he has an urgent message for the outlander who defeated Regala. So, stated. It's for her alone. From an interested party. I'm gonna need some privacy. Clear the room. Put him with the rest of Regala soldiers. I'll see you back at base. You saved the tribe. Let me help you with your mission. No. With Regala gone, you have a chance to build the future you dreamed of. So get to your task. Then at least allow me to give you this. Armor for the battle ahead. May it keep you safe. Thank you. It's a pleasure to see you too, Silence. Congratulations on your victory. You saved the Tanakh for a few weeks. Unfortunately, you doomed the entire planet as well. Wrong. I don't need a Tanakh army to defeat the Xenus. Oh, Eloy. Have you learned nothing about the enemy we're up against? More than you, hiding whatever hole you found. My idea is just better than anything you ever came up with. No, not here. We're doing this my way. Face to face, and with the weapon you've developed. And why would I agree to that? 
Because I'm your only way of beating the Zeniths, and getting the copy of Apollo that's on their ship. So meet me at my base. Mountains west of Plainsong. Time to submit to the inevitable silence and follow the person who actually knows what she's doing. Don't be late. Tilda, you there? I did it. Silence is on board. So head to my base. Impressive. Okay. I'll be there as soon as I can. Now the Mr. Know-it-all is here. You know, your focus, buddy, who never smiles. I didn't know what to do with him, so I had him wait in your room. Got it. Thanks. Well, Silence, looks like you finally found a door you could open without me. I'm glad it's there, actually. It kept me from having to mingle with the company you keep. But enough prattle. I believe you owe me an explanation. Your plans for the Zenith base? You're right. I do owe you. My spear in your throat for deceiving me again. At the Hades Proving Lab. I doubt you asked me here for that kind of reckoning. No. Right now, I need your help. So I'm giving you one final chance. But if you ever betray me again, I will kill you no matter what the circumstance. Understood? Very well. Though we'll both face a decidedly short future if you can't get us inside that base. Aloy, your other guest is here. She's, um, coming to you. Thanks. Good timing. The truth is, I can't actually get us into the base. But, she can. The company you keep is even worse than I thought. Not a fan of surprises, are you? Oh, well, look. That must be your little invention. Does the weapon work? Without self-destructing? Of course it does. I've eliminated the imperfections and greatly improved its design and output. How can we be sure? Care for a demonstration. Enough, both of you. We're in this together, at least for now. Go talk to Erend. Tell him I said to give you rooms of your own. I'll come see you when I get a chance. Oh, no. You first. Better get everyone in the control room, so Tilda can tell us what she knows about the Zenith base. Oh, uh, before I forget, I watered those plants for you. Huh? I just know they meant a lot to you.
Just you wait, Varl. We're taking those space lugs down. Okay. Maybe it's time to get everyone together so Tilda can brief us. But is there anything I should handle before that? <laughs> 